afternoon, afternoon, afternoon. The time is. Let me just finish my heart rate money out because I'm finished with cardio. It's 12 30. That is the time here in London town where we are. Just finished my training session. Um, how can I round it up? It was good. I felt very strong, which is a positive sign. Um, I think I just, I trained earlier than usual. So I trained around 10, 10.30, which is, I usually train about one. But I just felt, I felt pretty tired. Like nothing hunger wise, hunger wise was cool. I'm um, not hungry, Feel, felt full of, like I got a good pump, a strong pump. Maybe you can see it. Um, yeah, I got a good pump. But it was just, mentally, I just, I dreaded it, if I'm honest. Like, as bad as that sounds, I dreaded doing the workout. I thought, oh, I really can't, can't bother to do it. I just want to get it over and done with. Um, but obviously, as you do, 10, 15 minutes into it, I started to get a bit into it. Um, got a few, got a PB. Got PBs on pretty much everything to be honest. But I think I'm at where I've been doing this for three, three, four weeks, three, three or four weeks. I think I'm kind of at my ceiling, so I need to. Obviously, next week we're going to change the workout. Um, it's getting pretty tough, and form starting to take its toll. Like I'm just kind of having to neglect form just to get the weight up, which is a bugger because I'm a form guy. I love to get my form in check. Um, so conclusions on how today's session was it was cool um, I could have been a bit more motivated to go into it in terms of hunger levels no issue there I'm actually looking forward to having a bit more meat today um, a bit more protein obviously protein was low yesterday because we had the carbs um, but hey I'm done with it so done that finished off with the normal 30 minutes cardio done cardio in the morning looking tight and that's all i've really got to report to you guys at the moment so i'm gonna go home and it's transfer deadline day so i'm gonna go home and watch that get a meal in and kind of just yeah like maybe have a nap or something i haven't had a power nap in a while and I'm waking up early, going to bed at 11, waking up at 4. Maybe I just need a nap. Um, I don't know, what do you guys suggest? Like, what, what do you think? I'm gonna try that anyway. Gonna have a nap. Um, I re I'm meant to be getting my hair cut today, but I might wait and get it done tomorrow. What do you think? What should I go for? What do you guys like? Um, do you like the curly hair? Do you like the straight quiff kind of hair? Let me know. Interact with me, dude. Um, so yeah. That's probably it for now. I'll probably check in with you guys later on. Not too sure. But yeah. Catch you guys later on. Question is, can you even see me? Hopefully you can, because I'm recording and I really can't be bothered to change this. Um, what was I gonna say though? I was gonna say if I can get my keys. Hold up there. Um, so today's been an interesting day. It's been a tough day. I'm honest with you. But it's been a tough day. Whoops. It's been a tough day, but um, just finished a class and it's kind of, I mean, classes, clients, they all motivate me. I mean, every, I'm motivated already to wake up, get shit done, etc, etc. But, I mean, I come, I come into a class and the room is electric. It's electrified. Like the rock. But it is though, it is like literally electrifying. Like everybody's there. 
ready to just pounce and get shit done and it's just like this is what fitness this is what it's all about guys it's all about that waking up doing it finding what you enjoy doing what you enjoy um not wanting to put stuff off um enjoying everything whilst you can exercising because it's fun not because you have to do it because it's a chore um and i, I would admit i'll be the first to and i get caught up in that, this cycle as well and sometimes find myself doing stuff that i don't particularly enjoy um, in terms of my exercise regime but then that's when I, I do take two steps back and I think why am I doing this and I find the root and then I get the real reason why I do it because I love it I love working out I enjoy living a fit lifestyle I enjoy looking good naked who doesn't like let's be real let us be real um, I enjoy putting myself through tough sessions, I enjoy squatting, I enjoy lifting heavy weight, I enjoy looking in the mirror and getting a good pump, I enjoy eating good food, I enjoy eating donuts as well, which is where I find balance, so obviously now where I'm at, pretty close, well not pretty, eight weeks to competition, about two months, um, that stuff has to be, that can only be implemented when and when need be, but I mean, I just look at it like, if I wasn't enjoying it, why would I do it? So the key, really, what I'm trying to say is, find find a way of exercising that you enjoy. Find a way of exercising that keeps you healthy. Find something that's going to test you. Find something that's going to make you want to be better tomorrow. It's going to make you feel like yesterday was easy so for me yesterday was piss easy today was tough but then tomorrow i'm gonna make it i'm gonna make today feel easy and tomorrow's gonna be tough as well and that's what i enjoy i enjoy a challenge anything that's too easy is not worth doing in my opinion in terms of work in terms of business in terms of working out in terms of clients so every if every client obeyed and listened to everything i said it would be very flipping easy but that's the whole nature of kind of what I do. Enjoy it, get it done, enjoy what you're doing. Make it test you as well. Nothing in life is easy, but it's gonna test you. There's gonna be days when stuff does test you. And they're the days that, they're the days that count, to be honest. When you get tested, you get stronger. You learn as part of my team we always learn if you're in a room where you don't learn or you know everything you're never gonna keep learning and in life there's always new things to learn so I'm gonna leave it there before I run off on a different tangent but I just wanted to kind of say that you've got to find stuff you enjoy enjoy what you do and surround yourself with like-minded people everybody in my classes all my clients that sometimes we do group training they surround themselves with obviously they're with somebody who wants to achieve the same goal when you can put yourself in a room with like-minded people you're bound to get somewhere it's like the saying you are like you are the person you spend you are you are basically a replica of the five people you spend the most time with. Finally got it out. Finally. But it's true. If you spend your time with weasels, you're not gonna get anywhere. Weasels, yeah, they're weasels. Spend your time around people that don't do nothing good. Spend your time with people that consistently give up. Spend your time with people that make excuses. I can guarantee you're gonna be one of them people that make excuses as well. <laughs> You're going to be one of them people that say, oh, I can't do it because of this, because of that person. Take responsibility, take accountability, and I can guarantee you guys, you'll finally find a place where you're happy, sustainable, getting results, and more importantly, having fun. On that note, fitness.
Sesh, signing out, and I'll catch you guys.